Hi, Cyberspace here, back with another Distance Incremental video, episode 6, and I actually have done some off-camera progression since last episode. I have gotten myself a few more cadavers, so yeah, I, I got, I think, 15 cadavers in one run, or maybe it was 16, so yeah, I can reliably get like 8 cadavers. Also, I grinded a lot of time cubes here, E9, so yeah, I can... I guess I, I should try to increase the magnitude of fuel bot and maybe start lowering the interval a little bit. And then I guess I can, I can't even do anything else with any of the other bots. So yeah, that's what, that's that. And yeah, I'm just going to reset progress to gain, gain nine cadavers, but then I have to sacrifice, actually before I sacrifice all of them into life essence, I will um, just get a, um, get a stock of just a few cadavers like, even if it's just, like, three or so, that's good, because I I want, like, this upgrade, which gives me, like, 11 times as many rockets, but I don't want to lose this 30 to 36 times time speed boost, so, yeah, I, I can easily get all these, these upgrades and, and E7 time cubes, then just get probably up to, probably want to get something like nine rocket fuel, I, I don't even, I don't even need that much, but nine would be nice and this will allow me to hopefully yeah it'll, it'll allow me to reach um a few cadavers yeah it's about five cadavers here or four yeah five cadavers so now i'm going to sacrifice all of them to life essence and this will have 55 life essence so I, I keep all time reversal upgrades on reset and time speed multiplies rocket gain at a reduced rate so yeah, this is, this is definitely going to help. It may be a little bit slower, but since I have all these time reversal upgrades, the, the early part of the of the runs should be super fast. And then I'm, I'm guessing just since the early part is so fast, I can easily gain cadavers. Um, I, I really wish the, the bots were a little more effective because actually it's not just the bots being more effective. I just want it to be... I don't want tiers to reset ranks and a lot. But anyway... It's only one cadaver. I thought I was going to be able to get more than just one cadaver. I, st I still need to go time reversal. That's still a thing because it gives me like three free rocket fuel, which is yeah pretty important if I want to actually make real progression. And now, yeah, I can gain this. I could, if I wanted, go all the way up to 11 rocket fuel because I'm, I'm getting a billion rockets each time. So um, maybe I, instead I will just gain like six cadavers that seems a little better that's going to be almost a double um speed boost so yeah i i think the strategy here is to go up to about seven rocket fuel and then grind up to like a million or so time cubes and then just get a few more rockets to the point where i can get maybe 10 rocket fuel maybe if i want to go time reversal one more time that could be useful but I'm, I'm not exactly sure how useful that'd be, but yeah, I mean, I, I can, I can easily reach this in just like a few more, more runs. So I'm, I'm going to go for that. And then I'm not exactly sure how many cadavers I, I'm going to be able to get, but it should be pretty good. And I should be, I'm also want to go back up to E10 rockets. And then I also want to go time reversal just to get more time cubes and, and this will allow me to get maybe up to somewhere around 50 million or even just 30 million here and this will allow me to gain seven cadavers I thought it was gonna be this is eight cadavers I guess that's okay not as much as I really thought I was gonna do um, this is definitely gonna help the gain one percent of rocket gain every second but this is the big one Life Essence boosts cadaver gain. I'm I really want that because that is a 43 times boost to cadaver gain. So I I guess I'll just gain these nine cadavers, which is enough to get me 75 um, with one reset. Of course, I don't want to immediately do that because um, I would lose all my cadavers, which means I lose all my time speed boosts. So yeah, I think I'm just gonna grind up to 10 10 million here and then just. I'm, I'm not even sure if I want to grind all the way up to, like, 11 rocket fuel. Maybe just 10 is enough. Yeah, I feel like just 10 
is going to be enough here. I, I, I mean, I could try for 11. Actually, yes, yeah, now just Sophie runs, and I'm just going to do it. Um, so, yeah, this will ease, allow me to easily get tens of billions of rockets, which should help me gain a lot of cadavers. Yeah, seven cadavers. Maybe we can even gain eight. And now if I convert it into life essence, I'll be gaining 1% of rockets every second. And now with the eight cadavers, with all that, it's going to... Yeah, this is going to be... This is extremely useful. Now it, it boosts the beginning of runs even more. And, like, it, it's... I really... I barely have to click. Like, maybe I should just... I feel like I should just do shorter runs because the early parts of the runs are just so much faster than before. Like, maybe I should push up to maybe 10 rocket fuel, but I think that's about it. I don't, I really don't think I need much more than that. And that will allow me to gain like five, maybe six cadavers. And just, I'm just gonna do that a bunch of times. And that was six cadavers. So maybe just two more of these types of runs. And that will allow me to get the life essence boost cadaver gain. This is, this is huge. I, I want this so bad, just so I can, because this is going to make the tiers do not reset ranks super easy to get. So, yeah, I have 34 million time cubes. I should easily be able to get all the way up to 10 rocket fuel. If I want, I could go up to 11, but I don't think I really need to. And I'll be able to get six cadavers. Just gonna keep doing this. All I need now is five cadavers. That's, that's it. I need five cadavers in order to get this life essence boost cadaver gain. And I'm pretty close to actually unlocking pathogens, which is at 250,000 cadavers. It may seem far away, but I think it's it's going to be pretty easy to get. So here is nine rocket fuel. I should be able to reach 10 here. And just a few more um, rocket runs will allow me to get five cadavers i need to do one more run just just so i can get back up to where i was i don't even need to get as far as i usually go like just like this far is enough and then sacrifice all into life essence and boom 124 cadaver 126 cadavers and this is the first case where it gives the soft cap in parentheses i have no idea where the soft cap comes in but yeah that's what it is so 146 cadavers this gives me an achievement for reaching 66 cadavers and yeah now it's gonna now it's gonna be insanely fast nine rocket fuel without any time cubes with time cubes i'm gonna be going up to like 500 million time cubes i'll be able to get nine ten probably even 11 rocket fuel like super easily maybe i could even get 12 rocket fuel perhaps and I'm going to be able to gain hundreds of cadavers. I'm not exactly sure how much I want to get, but it's going to be a lot. And also, I think if I do sacrifice it into life essence, that will... It's right now 46 times. This is now 50 times. And it's 451 cadavers. And maybe just one... Maybe just one more of these runs will allow me to get the tears do not reset ranks, which I really, really want because I that resetting thing is just so annoying and i mean there's still like the ranks resetting everything but it's still not nearly as bad so yeah i should i can gain 10 billion time cubes oh my god this this is insane this really isn't Let, let's see how much this upgrade's affected actually it's not affected a lot but whatever it's 38 billion time cubes which will allow me to gain E10 rockets, I, I'm going to go all the way up to 12 rocket fuel, because why not? I I can I can definitely reach that, and I don't, I don't think I'm going to be able to get the um, 13 rocket fuel here, but it's still just, yeah, I have 200 billion rockets. This allows me to get 1,300 cadavers. This is insane. Again, I'm going to go life essence so I can get a little more. 1,548 cadavers. And yes, I would want that, but I think this t time going 200,000 times faster is a little more important. I could even just do this. Like, like I barely need to do anything. Maybe I just 
maybe I will just sacrifice it all into life essence. And it'll it'll be a little bit slower, but not really. Because now I can just do this. I can just click this like once every second. And it gives me like 10% more cadavers. More than 10%. It's like more like 15% more cadavers. So yeah, you can just see how insane this is. If I actually if I actually go reverse time, it's gonna be a lot better. Yeah, 700 um, cadavers. Just keep doing this. 100 billion time cubes. Maybe I'll even get a trillion time cubes out of this. And this is um, over a thousand cadavers. I only need I need 10,000 to be able to get the ranks do not reset anything, which would be pretty useful. I'm just gonna keep doing runs like this because this I, this I feel I feel like would be the best type of run. And there's actually another achievement. Super smart reach. 1e10 intelligence. Ooh. That's actually interesting. You can you can buy max robot upgrades. Okay, I should def I think I should do fuel bot. Yeah, this should be more. I should get this interval going. I also want this magnitude and interval a little bit um yeah, magnitude higher, interval lower, and this should definitely help automation, even though it's, even though I barely need it at this point because now yeah, here is the ranks do not reset any everything. Once I yeah, get this and sacrifice it all into life essence, I think I'm on tier six now. Oh my god. I have E13, E14 universes. So yeah, this this is this is getting more and more insane. Here we go. Ranks do not reset anything. And that's another achievement. Reach all 12 class milestones. And cadaver gain is doubled again. So yeah, that's 10,000 cadavers. Um, nothing resets now. All I have to do is, is this. I can gain quadrillion time cubes. E4 cadavers. I should be easily able to unlock pathogens. And yeah, this is... Yeah, this is insane. I Here's another achievement. No more thinking. Reach 90, 15 time cubes, and time goes by 10% faster. And this one is, the multiverse is ever expanding. Go at least two E22 universes. The rocket fuel reset only resets rockets to 50% of the current amount. That's, that's actually really good. Let's see. I'm uh, up to E9 universes. Maybe if I stop getting time cubes, I can go... Um, farther, yeah. E seventeen universes, I could probably easily get to E twenty two universes, especially if I just keep getting like cadavers like this. Like this is probably the best way to gain cadavers, so I can um, unlock pathogens. I think I, I do want to get that one achievement though. So yeah, here it is. Um, one point six E five. I just need a little bit more. I'm at two E five and. Pathogens are incoming now. That seems wrong. <laughs> that, that shouldn't be a good thing, but in this game, that is a good thing. Somehow. I know. I'm up now up to E20 universes. I can probably... Okay, I thought I was going to get more time cubes there, but yeah, I'm just going to wait to get to, to two E22 universes. There's actually something right here that's right before two E22. It's a little annoying, but it's a rank up, so... it. Should be pretty good. Anyway, this is also reset your ranks, but time goes 50% faster. So that, so that should definitely help. And also, yeah, the ranks don't even reset anything. So here is the achievement. Now, um, the rocket fuel reset only resets rockets to 50% of their current amount. And yeah, next time I reset all progress to gain cadavers, I will be able to unlock pathogens. So yeah, hope you enjoyed. Peace out.